What's good YouTube? It's your boy KT. Today, technically what I'm just going to show you is you actually can get your free throw rating up on 2K. I watched a video earlier of some dude talking about some you can't get your free throw rating up. I don't remember the dude's name, but you actually can. He was showing all this, and it's not a free throw rate, and yada, yada, yada. Then he went to his thing, but actually, this is how you get your free throw rating up right here. You see your badges, right? I'm grinding for my code, Anchor Breaker Badge, by the way. Need some people to play with at the park or whatever you want to call it, playground, etc. But basically, what you do is, with a badge at, I think I passed it. I should have a yeah free throw ace this badge is what puts your free throw up right here my free throw was a 65 it put it up to a 75 rating so you technically just want to shoot as much free throws as you can make a good percent even even though it's kind of hard because your free throws are 65 well mine was normally centers be lower so just make a decent amount of percent of free throws just keep trying to get to the line and shoot free throws get buckets so it went up to 75 and I noticed that last game cause he was making like way more free throws and I'm just like okay I see you then I looked at my free throw rating and actually you can look at your free throw rating I was watching some dude earlier talk about some you can't look at your free throw rating you can look at your free throw rating you just can't do it while you in this gym so as soon as you go outside this gym, you can look at your free throw rating. But if you're in this gym, it does not show your free throw rating. Or I want to say it's your shot IQ, which is right above your free throw rating. It doesn't show that. And basically, I'm just doing this drill because this is easy money from my YouTube video earlier. It's just too easy. Still same move, spin move. It works about nearly every time. They can't guard it. I got a little better with the pass and I'm still working on my diamond and pick a roll maestro. And it's crazy, my dude's a slasher, and he does not dunk that much. Now, I don't know what they did on that last possession. They just they just just collapsed on my player like like I'm a god. Like they just collapsed in on me. So I would be showing y'all the little free throw badge, but I'm really trying to grind for this badge. It's pick and roll maestro and this timer. Cause my team they need help. They need as much help as they can get. My team act like they can't shoot at all. So I got to grind for this silver badge. Try to get the gold. Yada, yada. But on this free throw badge, basically all you got to do is I'll put it on pro, play on 12 minute quarters, try to drive in, pump fakes, try to get fouled as much as you can. Get to the free throw line, make them free throws. And it's just that simple like you can actually get your your free throw rating up shooting free throws from the line to get the badge at first doesn't put your free throw rating up but it helps get the badge easier even though half the time your dude misses because it's rated a 65 like why does your player free throw rating always start off so sorry I just don't understand like and I'm just cupping them, showing y'all what I do when I practice with the team. It's too easy. They can't guard me. Like, it's way too easy out here. They just can't guard me. I don't want the ball. But somebody tell me if you can get traded on here. Like, I really need to know that because I... I made a terrible decision of going to the Lakers. I ain't never played with a team, so sorry. Nobody on their team can shoot. Brick Lopez got to be the best player on the team. Other than my dude, excuse me. Other than my dude, Lonzo Ball shows up every once in a while. He throws me nice alley-oops. Other than that, Jordan Clarkson, I don't know what he be thinking. His 2K logic is dumb. I pass him the ball while he's wide open in the corner. Then he will run into the defender. And then shoot a shot in his face, and I just be like, "Really, Jordan? Really?" So I just don't understand, and I don't get why my dude's a slasher but never dunks the ball. Like it's so rare to see my dude dunk. I don't, I don't understand that. Somebody tell me about this. Why does my dude not dunk the ball? 
Okay, 6-6 six, six. and his dunk is a 75. I got dunk packages. He just doesn't dunk it. Even when I got the baseline reverse dunk package, and he still do a reverse dunk. Well, layup, I mean. Like, he never dunks the ball. I just don't understand. About to try to get out of here. Show y'all that you can see your free throw right here. See how you... But in here, you can't see it. So... As you see, this is normally where it'd be. It'd be somewhere around here. But now once I leave and exit the gym, you can see his free throw rate. And your shot IQ is automatically a 99. But my news was, I'm hoping that everybody else's shot IQ is a 99. Even though I really don't think that affects anything. Some YouTuber had me worried at first talking about you can't upgrade your free throw rate. And I'm like, hold on, wait a minute now. Wait a minute. Back that up. I can't upgrade my free throw rate and I can't be a 65 my whole career. What NBA superstar can't shoot three throws except LeBron? Like, come on now. I ain't trying to shoot 68% my whole career. I'm trying to be a GOAT. I'm trying to get in the 90s. I want that swoosh life. All about the buckets. You can't be about buckets and you shooting 65% from the free throw line. Oh, uh, you still can't see it? Wow, so you can't see it outside here. But basically, if you go in the game, you can see it go to the game locker room and it should show it the 2k pregame show I never watched this so I just skip right past it I don't even know why they put this in 2k that boy Shaq got a bald head My squad get buckets. I average more rebounds than the center. That's sad. I'm a shooting guard. Like, that's that's really sad. I average more rebounds than the center. And, of course, you know I average the most points on the team. Of course, I'm a walking bucket from my perspective in life. I'm a bucket. She said, spray water in my booty. <laughs> <laughs> That's his dance moves. Man, I ain't doing that. Get out of here. So let's see if I can see it in here. All I want to see is my freak throw rate. No, still, are you kidding me? Wow, that's crazy. So you actually got to go in the game just to see your free throw rate. See, normally it'd be up under shot off dribble. I seen it earlier. It's a 75. I just looked at it in my last game. So you actually got to be in the game just to see your free throw rating. 
But basically, when you do get that badge, bronze, it put it up five. So I'm assuming, no, it puts it up ten. My bad. But I'm assuming it puts it up ten every time you upgrade it. And I'm betting it's a gold badge. It better be a gold badge. Because I want my free throw to be a 95. Because I ain't trying to miss from the line. There it goes. See, it's a 75. I just wanted to prove my case. But you actually got to go into the game to see your free throw rating. Wow, 2K. You making us travel just to see our free throw rating? What if I wanted to go play pro am? And my man's, I can't look at his free throw rating because I got to go. He got to go in the game just to look at his own free throw rating. Come on, 2K. You can do better. But it's your boy, KT. I just want to see. Slash show y'all how you see your free throw rating and how you get your free throw up.